Hey everybody, it's I Want To Be Retro. Today we're going to take a look at running Libra Photos in Docker. So after getting logged into the server that's going to be running Docker, we need to install a few prerequisites that are required to get Docker up and running. Next we're going to add the Docker GPG key and app repository. And finally install Docker, Docker Compose, and Container D. Once the installation completes, we're going to make sure the Docker service is running and add the current user to the Docker group. Now that Docker is up and running, we're going to use OpenSSL to generate a random 32 character string, then create all the working directories we're going to need for our Docker container. We'll set the ownership of the working directories and create a Docker network. Then we'll start a Postgres database container. Once the database is running, we can run the Libra Photos backend container. Next, we can start the Libra Photos frontend container. Then we'll start the Libra Photos proxy container. And finally, we'll start the Redis 6 container. With all four of the Docker containers running, open a web browser and navigate to the DNS or IP address of the Docker host, port 8088. Log in with the admin username and password set in the backend docker run command. Welcome to Libra Photos running as a Docker container. 